Until 1991, this site at the old Plough Lane was home to Wimbledon FC, one of the most treacherous away days for any visiting side. Next summer, League One's AFC Wimbledon will be moving to a new home just a couple of hundred yards down the road. The FA Cup certainly holds special memories and the spirit of the Crazy Gang still lives on. <laughs> you have such a rich history of playing in the same team as one another. Who is the better player? <laughs> <laughs> what a great question. <laughs> I played longer, but I had more appearances. He was cut short. He, he was more talented than me, but uh, you know, I used to do his work for him. I didn't want to say that. The crazy gang culture was well documented. In terms of the dressing room, certainly a lot of things that happened back then wouldn't be happening now. I'm not going to have a go at you if we're trying to do something, but if you're passing the buck and trying to hide, then we're going to be falling out. It would be vocal, you know, there'd be rows, there'd be, there'd be all sorts of things going on um, and encouraged by the manager, and we would try and solve problems or we'd, we'd have an opinion. Now, you know, it just seems a little bit different. The boys are quieter. Maybe, you know, we've got to make a few more decisions for them because, you know, we're, we're one group. The club are moving into this brand spanking new stadium not far from the old ground. How exciting is it? Well, the, the, what I like about this ground right now, this reminds me of Plough Lane. The feeling, the atmosphere, you know, the, the, the bars, the, the setup, everything reminds me of going back 40 years of how it was. Wimbledon as a club, or AFC Wimbledon as well, have sort of thrived on this underdog status, and you're certainly that going into the weekend. Is that something you thrive on? In the FA Cup, the cameras have been live on Wimbledon because they were the ones that were going to get beat. Haringey Borough and Halifax aren't in the league, so we weren't the underdogs for those games. So now we've got to show the same tenacity and spirit that those clubs showed against us. Both of you played in this fixture back in 1985. What are your memories of that one? We felt we could beat anybody at Plough Lane. And I, was, I actually was injured, but stupidly, I thought, I can't take this opportunity not to play against him. And I, I came off injured, and Wally replaced me. He was very, You were sucked. You were sucked. I said, I, I couldn't continue. We were one nil down when you were taken off and I was put on. Oh, right, OK. I sure, resurrected sure. the club and got on the valuable replay. Excellent. And, I, did, uh, I wasn't sure about that. You didn't make it into I'll the second. I'll have to second. check that. Have no, to check no that. believe me, it's true. Are going to turn off the hot water in the away dressing room? No, we, we, we never did no. that. Everybody says that, but we just had a really ropey boiler. It just didn't work. It was the same <laughs> oh, for us. Oh, I see. You know, That's they used to come down was. and say how bad the facilities were. They were equally bad in our dressing room as they were in the away dressing room. <laughs> <laughs>